Humble yourself, therefore, under the mighty hand of God, that he may exalt you in due time. That's the scripture Taylor Gabriel's mom, who was a gospel singer, read to him every night. Taylor keeps that Bible with him at all times with a picture of his mother, Kimberly, inside. I think she always told me that I would be a champion. She believed in me more than I believed in myself. And she would always just tell me just to stay humble, be patient, wait, because my time would always come. Taylor's mom died from a brain aneurysm when Taylor was just 15 years old. I just broke down into tears. I didn't, I didn't want to talk to anybody. I locked myself in a room and didn't want to come out. In high school after your mom passed away, you almost quit. What made you decide to keep playing? Just felt like something in me, like it was her telling me that I had to go back out there and play football. That's why I feel like I work so hard because it's not just for me, it's my mom. I don't want to let my mom down. He dominated in high school. He went on to a Division II school, Abilene Christian, where he finished his career ranking second in school history in catches, yards, and touchdown receptions. That's the pick number four, Taylor Gabriel. Then, in 2014, he got a tryout with the Cleveland Browns, but few thought he had any shot of actually making the team. When I got here, I just wanted to prove to everyone that I shouldn't, I shouldn't be a tryout. I shouldn't be an undrafted free agent. I should have been a draft pick. All right, good. You make the team, and then you have over 600 receiving yards, over 30 catches in your first season, one touchdown. And that one touchdown was <laughs> the Tampa Bay game. Yeah. Do you think your mom was watching that game? Yeah. I feel like I kind of felt her there at that game, celebrating with me, scoring my first NFL touchdown. Taylor says he now feels like football brings him closer to his mother as he plays with her in and literally on his heart. Her name in it and loving memory, it's just something that I look at when I look in the mirror like, man, that's crazy. I'm in the NFL and you was right, mom. Your little boy has made it.